everybody, welcome back. So Catherine and I unfortunately had to do a little trickery and I got my little smalls locked in the lockout. She is gonna go on funcation today. guilt tripping me you guys. <laughs> Alright, so Dylan and Valerie are taking the squeeze cage in. Probably gonna have to help with the rope. So you'll have to bear with me on that. Yep, she's my operant cat so Gave her a couple treats to get her in there, and Catherine closed the door. And <laughs> she's like, maybe I can dig my way out. You're okay, baby girl. <laughs> so she's going on Funcation. That is a 22,000 square foot enclosure. And by the way, this is Smalls at Big Cat Rescue in Tampa, Florida, if I didn't already say that. Is this really her first time? I thought she went out one other time. Nope. Okay, so yeah, this would be her first time. Her first time. She did give me a pitiful look. <laughs> it's gonna take a lot of treats to regain her trust. <laughs> Catherine, radio. No. Mark, I'm moving a cat. Can it wait? This will be her first time on Funcation. Got it? Yep. Step back. You're okay, baby. I got the door. Do you want to rattle the tile on the top of her water and mm -hmm. see if that maybe scooches her this way? Yep. Just to make sure she does not scooch through that. Come on, baby girl. I've got it. Okay. <laughs> That's not something you get from small <laughs> Yeah, that's not a noise you usually hear from small, so puts it back in perspective. No matter how sweet she is, she's a wild little girl. letting her true self out. <laughs> yeah, Lee, it's 22,000 square feet. 
Yeah, Catherine, do you want Maya to pick up the treats? Uh, yeah. Okay, yep. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's, I think, what flashes in their mind. It's 50-50. Is this a vet visit or is this something fun? So, lucky for her, it's fun. <laughs> Hello, George. <laughs> yeah, hopefully, because she's so active and young that she'll really enjoy it on my golf cart. Oh yeah, Ginger was as easy to get home as she was to get out there. Uh, Jamie uh, Small's Bobcat is one of our permanent residents and this is her first funcation. Linda, Keisha's actually doing quite well for her condition. You guys can learn about her at bigcatrescue.org slash smalls. because it's still kind of a wide open space and they really enjoy being able to hide. But she'll have an area that she will be able to hide. There's a lot of covered area as well. It's just near the back. And I'm hoping she takes full advantage of the space. We all know she has the zoomies every morning, so it'd be lovely to see her get to take that out in all that space. Hey Mark, we got small. <laughs> Yes, Smalls is one of my operant cats. That's why you didn't get to witness her actually being caught because I was the one with the treats and the stick. <laughs> and Catherine's the one that closed the door, so. I'm gonna have to work real hard to re regain her trust again. <laughs> There's Paula. Hi, everybody! Facebook Live! <laughs> Paula's here on a tour. still out there or not. So this is Funcation for those of you that don't know. 22,000 square foot enclosure, tons of platforms and dens. Okay. Let her out there. A little insider story that your people yeah. might find interesting. Okay. Whenever you do... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever you do a rescue and there's a lot of cats involved, a lot of times the crates all arrive and we have to figure out which cat's name goes with which cat. Mm -hmm. And so there were six that came from this one from Spirit of the Hills in South Dakota all at one time, four mm -hmm. bobcats and two cougars. And we figured that the small bobcat must be the one named Smalls <laughs> until we started looking at the paperwork and realized that Smalls was a female and Nabisco was the littlest one at the time. So we were calling him Smalls for a while until we figured out, no, he's not Smalls. Right. Because he's the smallest one. <laughs> yep. That's... At some, some point she must have been the smallest one. Yeah, now. yeah, I would say, yeah. I think it's very fitting now. I was a little bummed in the beginning. I'm like, oh, I liked it the other way, but I think it's adorable now. <laughs> All right, so they will put her up to that larger door there. And let her go on out. I 
know Carol's so awesome, isn't she? <laughs> I, I hate that she's stressed, but I love her showing her attitude. <laughs> Just really reminds you, and she's so cute and sweet in the mornings, but you can hear that bobcat attitude. Smalls Bobcat going on funcation here at Big Cat Rescue in Tampa. Yes, yeah, if if and when she comes out of there, she's probably gonna go pretty fast. She's a sweetie pie, yeah. I'm gonna have to work a lot with her. But yeah, if you love Carol's shirt, you can go to catrescue.biz or you can also find it on Amazon. So smile.amazon.com slash bigcatrescue. You can also go to bigcatrescue.org slash Amazon store and find all of our products there as well. Ready? You ready, Brittany? Yep. Hi, little girl. Come on, sweet girl. her options right now. Come on, sweet girl. Yeah, and I can post those links for you guys when I get back to my desk as well. Oh, smalls. Come on, baby girl. Come on. You're okay. Oh, she's breaking my heart. <laughs> Go pumpkin. Oh, oh, watch her run. I love it. Oh, I actually love watching her run that far. That was awesome. And she's out of here. All right, well, let's go back and we'll say hi to her. I want her to know that she's okay. You're okay, baby girl. <laughs> Look at her running. Oh, it's so nice to see her stretch her legs. All right, plus uh, I'll walk back there so that you guys can get a good idea of just how big this enclosure is. These are will be her feeding lockouts. She'll be out here for two weeks. And I'm hoping, 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 hoping that we'll be building her some platforms and maybe some shelves in her enclosure so that she has some new fun things to come home to, so. Fingers crossed we can make that happen. Let's see, so we're still walking. All of this is part of Funcation. She may have booked it for one of those other big dens, but most of our very small cats like to hang out in this back section because it's nice and quiet. It's far away from everybody. There's lots of little dens. Small girl! She might have gone into that really big den. I lost sight of her. Pharaoh's favorite spot when he's on Funcation is that little den right there. <laughs> She's out of here. Where'd you go? As you can see, there's a lot more foliage back here, which is why the smaller cats, like bobcats especially, tend to like to hang out back here. 
Well, she might have booked it into that big den. I can't really tell from here. Or she's already exploring. I love seeing them run like that. That's something that I really love about our big cat vacation rotation because they, the tigers can actually get up to the full running speed, which is just amazing. They can't do that when they're trapped in captivity. I know, Nancy, she's like, I am out of here. She's probably staring right at me too. It usually will take them, you know, a little bit of time to settle in. They do most of their exploring late at night when they first come out here for the first time. Baby girl. Well, I've got a lot of, a lot of makeup to do with this girl. I think she's in that really big den right there. Well, thank you, Sharon, for your donation. She just booked it. But you can see all the fun stuff that she'll get. Oh yeah, Jamie, bobcats mark things just like crazy. <laughs> lots of scratching, lots of peeing on everything. I don't think it helped that we've got weed whacking and mowing happening. Today's our day we're closed to the public, so that probably isn't helping all the racket. Well, I don't see her, which is kind of awesome. She's got enough space that she can just totally hide out, which I think is just incredible. Well, anyway, thank you guys so much for following along all day. Um, definitely go back onto our Facebook page. Uh, we did a lot today. So first thing this morning, I checked in with Apollo, who saw the vet yesterday. Um, after that, we moved um, Priya to a new enclosure and Kali home from vacation into a new enclosure. And then we moved Hoover on to vacation. Yay! Have lots of fun snapping photos of him on the Explore cameras. And now we have moved Smalls Bobcat to Funcation. So thank you guys so, so much for everything today. Really appreciate it. And I will uh, hopefully see you all again soon. Thank you.